Hey Cancer, I hope you're doing well. This is going to be a general love reading for the month of June. Um, so we're just going to pull for whatever comes out for the month of June and then we're going to go through all the signs and we're going to see um, their feelings and their next actions. Again, for the month of June, Cancer, I do have a deal going on right now for personals. It's for today. It's a same day special. It's um, three questions. It's $25. You get it within 24 hours. That's going on until today at 1 p.m. Eastern time. Details are down below if you are interested, of course, but we're going to go ahead and begin and see what we've got here for you. This is for Cancer. For Cancer June Love. Okay. Right. Some of you could be dealing with another water sign here. Your overall energy is the fool. Somebody wants to take a risk with you. I feel like you have like a secret admirer energy in your space. Um, you have two twos showing up here. Now, some of you, there could be a person who is wrapped up in something else. That could be why they're holding back. Could be. Um, some of you, they do feel like your cup is closed off. So this could have to do with the fact that you might be in a connection or they feel that you're in a connection. They're like, cancer's got to be in a connection. You know, so that could be the energy here as well. I mean, you got the, the high priestess. I feel like there are hidden feelings. I feel like there are hidden feelings. Somebody sees you as very supportive, very uplifting, attractive. Um, but the high priestess, I feel like they're holding this back. And the seven of pentacles, I do feel like they're evaluating you. They're watching you. I feel like they're waiting for some kind of green light here. Let me see if I can get any more, anything else on this. What else for this? Yeah, Cancer, I really don't know what else to say about this one. I mean, you have the Seven of Cups here. You have the uh, Ace of Wands. This person is like gushing over you. Some of you, this is a past person. Some of you, this could be why they're holding back. Maybe they're, um, maybe there was a bad ending in the past. That could be why they're holding back. This could be another Cancerian, maybe an Aquarius. Um, some of you a Pisces. This person, but they, they feel like you have a lot of options. I feel like they are intimidated by this. Yeah, I feel like they are. I feel like they're wanting you to take initiative with that two of wands energy. I don't know. I feel like they're wanting you to take initiative. They're, they're bashful um, or they're, they're either bashful or they're ashamed. Like there's something here that they did in the past. Oh, cancer. I don't know. Let's see what else we have. I'm going to go through the signs. Aries sees you as someone who is very supportive, will have their back 100%. Um, they see you as like best friend energy and you have 10 of cups showing up as their next actions. I feel like they want to progress with you. Leo's having a realization about this connection here, and I do feel like they're going to be taking more initiative um, in the month of June. I feel like they're wanting to move this forward. Sagittarius is isolating. They're, they're shutting down. They may feel like they may feel like they've gotten everything that they can get out of this connection. That's the best way I can describe that energy, even if it doesn't sound pretty. Taurus sees you as wish fulfillment, but I feel like they're communicating that in a more matter-of-fact way. Like, we, this could really work. You know, I just feel as if this is something that's being um, communicated in a lesser way than what it is that they feel. Virgo. Virgo sees you as life partner energy. Two of Wands. I feel like they do want to grow and expand with you here. Yeah. I feel like they're going to take initiative. Capricorn wants to plant new seeds with you. Um, they may feel like you're not giving enough to this. I feel like they're wanting to try something in a new way. I feel like they will be communicating that. Like, let's try it like this. Let's let's see how this works. That's the energy I'm feeling from the Capricorn. The Gemini may feel like you're distant or like you're moving on or like you're preoccupied. I feel like they're going to they're going to distract themselves is the energy I feel from the Gemini. Libra feels stuck on you. This Libra is from your past, but they're not doing anything about it. They may be wrapped up in something else with the Four of Swords energy. Um, I feel like they're stuck on you, but they're not doing anything about it. Aquarius thinks you feel like home, but I feel like they're shutting off their heart to you. They feel like this is something that's getting too serious or getting too um, heavy for them at this time. They may be dealing with other things at this time, but they are kind of like distancing themselves from this despite having a really strong connection to you. I feel like it has something to do with um, an external situation here. The fellow Cancerian may feel like you're closed off. There could have been a failed reunion with this person here, like something didn't work out another, like a second time. So there's even less trust than there was before. 
Scorpio has a lot of deep emotion for you here, but I do feel like they're burying themselves in work and other duties and responsibilities. Pisces very attracted or very attracted to you, admires you a lot. Um, yeah, admires you a lot, like looks up to you. Uh, King of Swords energy showing up for their next actions. I do feel like this Pisces is wanting to discuss something serious with you. So that's what I'm seeing here, Cancer. I hope this was helpful or fun or whatever you needed it to be. Details are down below for anybody who's interested in personals, Instagram or Patreon. Like I said, I do have that deal going on for personals until today at 1 p.m. Eastern time. It's a three question reading. It's $25. You get it within 24 hours. So everything's down there if you're interested, of course. But if this is where we part, thank you so much for being here. I really appreciate you. And hopefully I'll see you next time. Bye.